Today we have Levi who turned to St. Matthew just because he found meaning that is Jesus in his life. My dear friends in Christ Jesus, today we reflect on the gospel passage of Saint Mark chapter 2 verses 13 to 17 where Jesus calls Levi the Matthew. As a follower of Christ, this particular word of God, that is, those who are well have no need of a physician but those who are sick. I have come to call not the righteous but sinners has always been a treasure to be held on. Levi as a tax collector was a sinner, but the Lord chooses to call him who is a sinner just as he does for you and I. There was only one hidden idea that Jesus wanted Levi to understand, that is, he is worthy if he really wants to be. It is not God who makes us sinners or imperfect because out of goodness only goodness comes. But on the other hand, it is we who willingly give ourselves to sin. Still, remember, we are worthy if He really wants to be. Today, we have Levi who turned to St. Matthew just because he found meaning that is Jesus in his life. Peter, Augustine, Ignatius of Loyola were all sinners who became saints. And today, he stands before you and I, seeing all what we are and all what we have been through, asking, Dear son, dear daughter, follow me. No burial, no goodbye, no one said, only one sudden move, that is, follow him. When the woman who was caught in a sin was brought to Jesus, she thought she was going to be killed by being stoned. She thought the world abandons and hates her. But she was given love by Jesus. She wasn't unimportant but worthy and a loving child of God and she was asked to sin no longer. As you hear me telling sin no longer and follow him, there is no meaning unless we make an effort to follow him who calls us with his wounded hands. In the first reading we see Saul being chosen as king of Israel. And here Jesus chooses Levi to be an apostle. Being a chosen one of God, never become a mere puppet like Saul, who turned to be a sinner, but an instrument of gospel like Matthew, who stole the kingdom of God from Jesus. May Almighty God bless you and I. Amen.